Happy Sunday! Woo -woo -woo -woo. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do what I eat in a video for. Um, what I eat in a day video for you. I've got my onesie on so I'm super cosy and I've got no makeup on because I am filming the boyfriend does my makeup challenge later on so I thought there's no point putting any on because he's going to be doing it for me. Um, but yeah, let me get comfy. So I thought I would do um, a what I eat in a day and it isn't going to be a normal what I eat in a day because lately I've been a little bit off track. Um, I went out drinking with my friend um, and yeah, I haven't had the best couple of days, so I wanted to sort of do like a cleanse today. It's just a one day thing. I'm just gonna be eating just fruits and veggies. So I think I'm gonna have like a fruit smoothie for my breakfast, vegetable soup for my lunch, and I'm not sure about tea yet, but yeah, just to sort of give my digestive system a rest and just to, I feel heavy and I feel clogged up and I just wanna, you know, help my body replenish and feel better and then I'll go back onto Slimming World tomorrow so that is my plan for today so I thought I would show you what I eat and vlog it because it's a little bit different um but yeah I've had one coffee this morning and now I'm going to go and make my fruit smoothie so I will show you what I put in it and one thing I forgot to add is that I am not drinking alcohol now till Christmas um and I'm not that I drink a lot anyway I mean I'll, I often have a couple of glasses of wine at the weekend but I've just decided to completely cut it out because I feel like it is hindering my weight loss um, slightly so I, I made the decision to just stop drinking altogether until Christmas so yeah that is my plan so in my smoothie I'm just gonna put one banana um, some of this frozen, uh, this is tropical fruit, strawberry, peach, pineapple and mango um, from Tesco frozen, um, some summer summer berries, he's got blackberries, raspberries, black currants, red currants, these are really really good for you, best fruit for you, and then um, almond milk because we don't drink cow's milk, and some sweetener just because I find that these two can be a little bit uh, bitter sometimes in smoothies so I like to counteract it with some sweetener, but yeah. I'm going to pop all this in my Nutribullet and whiz it up. I actually ended up add, adding spinach into it as well to just get a few greens in there um, and it's so so nice it's thick creamy it's really really cold because of the frozen fruits it's full of antioxidants full of fiber and just really 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 good for you so mm. and the sweeteners are good cool because like I said the berries can sometimes make it a bit bitter but the sweetener really counteracts that, so I'm going to have this. Mm. And I'll see you in a bit. Guys, I'm venturing out of the house without any makeup on. Are we proud? <laughs> I feel quite liberated. Um, no, I need, to, I need to go and get carrots because I'm going to make carrot and coriander soup for lunch. And we have no carrots, so I'm going to go and get some. But I never leave the house without my face on. Oh well, so we're gonna. I'm gonna make lunch and then we're gonna film the video, um, and then I'm gonna eat it. Um, I still don't know what I'm having for tea, but Rob wants a lasagna, so I'm just gonna buy him one from the co-op because that's where I'm going now. Um, I don't know what I'm having for my tea yet. I haven't decided. The 
mission was a success and I got two bags of carrots, beef lasagna, garlic bread for Robbo. Okay, so I wanted to make a large amount of soup so that it would last me a few days. So I started by chopping up 800 grams of carrots and one large white onion. You can just do this really roughly and then I just whacked it in the soup maker but you can put it on the hob and use a hand blender if you prefer. And then I just added three cloves of garlic to the mixture and it looked something like this. I then season it with a uh, table salt, black pepper, ground coriander, two vegetable oxo cubes and some tomato puree and I just wax all of that in. Just do the sort of measurements that you fancy, I just sort of went with it. But I will put the exact measurements that I used down below so if you want to do this recipe just check out the um, description box. I then just set my soup maker to 20 minutes on the smooth settings so that it would be really nice and smooth and once that was done I added a handful of chopped coriander and then I poured it into my bowl and garnished with some more coriander. And this recipe was super hearty, super filling and it was just perfect for a cold winter's day. Hi guys, so it's about half five now and I'm getting really really peckish so I'm going to go down and make some tea. Um, still look like a hot mess, sorry I haven't bothered putting any makeup on today because I just couldn't be bothered. I've just been sat doing my Etsy orders all all day really because I'm just really really busy on my website at the minute I think with the run up to Christmas and everything so that's what I've been doing but I think I'm just going to have like a big salad bowl slash veggie bowl and just fill up on food that way tonight but yeah I'm going to go down and make some now and Rob's arrived. <laughs> um, yeah I'm just going to go and fill up on that now and I will show you what it looks like. Let's go make tea. So for tea I made a salad with mixed leaves, chickpeas, tomatoes, cucumber, pickled onions, peppers and then I made a mint and yoghurt dressing. I then topped that with sautéed cabbage and spinach and mushrooms and tinned tomatoes and I also roasted some kale with salt and pepper in the oven and sprinkled that on top. Mm. Like crispy kale at the minute is my obsession. Roasted with salt and pepper. Love it. It's like crisps. This is my um my tea. As you can see, it's a really big bowl. Don't know how you how I'll be able to tell. Look, look at it compared to Rob's head. See? It's massive. And then there I've got my salad with um which I've dressed with yogurt and mint, and then I've got my sauteed cabbage and mushrooms, and then I just topped it with this crispy kale. So yeah. We're gonna enjoy this big bowl of food now with home alone. Yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna eat this while we watch Home Alone. Hi guys, so I finished this whole big bowl of food and it was really nice. Um it's filled me up and I'm gonna end this video here because that's all I'm gonna eat. I'm not gonna eat any more today. Um I might have a cup of tea later on before bed. Um but yeah, that's it. Just wanted to have like a cleanse today and I'll be back on Slimming World tomorrow. Um, but I know this video is a little bit different with my eating habits. Oh, there's a fluff fluffing around. Some... Um, but yeah, give this video a, a thumbs up if you liked it so I know to do more what I eat in a day. And don't forget, to subscribe to, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!